Well, I think there is an emotional toll. Being an entrepreneur, you know, it, it's, it's celebrated and, and people you know, focus on the, the, the real success story. Steve Jobs, for example, how he started Apple and then you know, kind of came back and turned it around and, and created all these wonderful products. He's sort of an icon that you know, people you know, look up to and, and, and should look up to. Uh, but the reality is for most entrepreneurs, it's, it's actually a tough, tough journey. And, 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 and some do succeed, many try and fail. This is part of a process of, of startups, part of the process of, of being an entrepreneur. Even the ones who are, end up being successful, usually it's a circuitous path. Even with AOL, it, it really, you know, it took us more than a decade before we finally got traction. And we had probably three near-death experiences on that path where there were just you know, we lost partnerships that were critical, or we ran out of cash and had our back to the wall and had to lay off people, a variety of different different things. And that's pretty common, that we stuck with it. We had passion about the idea of getting America online, and we persevered and, and just figured out when there was an impediment, when there was sort of something in the, in the way blocking our progress, how to either kind of climb over that wall or climb around the wall or just figure out a way to knock the wall down. That's what entrepreneurs do.